Chairman, and I'm going to yield some of my time to the gentleman from Georgia, Mr. Westmoreland. And I'll only take 30 seconds. And I want to tell the gentleman from North Carolina, today's your lucky day. And I'd like to uh, present this evidence to Ms. Warren and ask her if it would prevent this from happening. Uh, I sought out a loan, a second mortgage, to go into business. I paid, uh, it was a five-year prepayment penalty. I paid six points up front. I probably paid 4 or 5% more than the going rate to be able to get a second mortgage on my home to go into business. And I'm proud to tell you that I was able to repay that. I was able to fulfill my dream of being in business for myself, and I have been in business for myself for 30 years. And what you're talking about today and what Mr. Miller is talking about today is, is preventing people from being able to fulfill the American dream when they know their self that they can do it. They can meet the challenge, but yet the government is going to tell them it's a bad deal, they can't do it, and not allow businesses to make those kind of loans. That's wrong. Thank you, and I yield back. Thank you, sir. Um, 